little bit of issue with the bridge or so I think. Um, what I'm seeing is you can see here the strings are further and further to this side as they go towards the treble side. And what's that what that's kind of doing is the biggest issue I have is that when I'm playing on a high E string, hammers and pulls tend to roll off the edge of the fretboard. Now, I can address that a little by just kind of pushing the saddles over and yeah, you can get like maybe half a millimeter that way. A little better. I think what may have happened, if you look at the bridge, there's a lot more spacing on the on the base side over here than it is on the treble side. It's possible that when they drilled the holes for the posts, it's uh, it's maybe a millimeter too far to the treble side, and that's kind of what's causing this. So fixing that's not an option. My options are really one, live with it. Two, send it back, obviously, and third, um, one thing I can tell is, I mean, th this is a, a it's, it's branded as Sterling, but this is a Goto bridge. Um, Goto makes one with the exact same dimensions that has a narrower um, string spacing. I think these are 10.8 millimeters. Um, the, the narrow ones are 10.5 millimeters. So it doesn't sound like a lot, but across the whole uh, six strings, that would be a, you know, a nar narrowing the whole thing by about a millimeter and a half which I think would address the issue. So I may invest in one of those go to bridges with a narrower um, string spacing, and that might make this better as well. So again, I don't know if this is, was just like a, a flaw in terms of where they put the posts, or if this is just the way it's designed. Um, it's, again, it's not a huge issue, but, but for me, you know, it's, it's really easy for this string to slide off. So again, I was able to push the saddles over, get a little bit of a better spacing, but um, in the long run, what I may end up doing is getting one of those go-to bridges with a narrower string spacing. Thank you.